hey everyone. I wanted to do something a little bit different today. And for that, I had the idea of uh, looking back at where I started, you know? So yeah, let's uh, take a look and uh, see now what I think of, of uh, these early videos and maybe give some insight into what was going through my mind at that point. <laughs> Alright, so this is Mabinogi, my uh, favorite game. All through uh, high school and everything, I just I spent so much time in this game, Mabinogi, and uh, I don't know why. I, just, I felt like, hey, uh, oh my goodness. That? Old mobby game. Okay. You need to play something that is so this was dead. like actually Maybe like an attempt at sort of a clickbaity sort of thing. Came from a game called VR of pretending that I, I hadn't played VR chat be before when um, I've, I've been like. playing VR chat since uh, October 2017. So by the time this came out, I was actually pretty. Um, I knew VR chat, but. This was an attempt to kind of uh, bring in a few, <laughs> a few views by pretending to be completely new. So that part was a bit of a lie. Oh man, this intro. So the, <laughs> the original intro is so long. <laughs> so we're now at two minutes in before it even starts. So now you're on a, you're on a good track when your video starts in like two minutes. Oh, away <laughs> the memories. So, okay, I, I've been playing for a little while at this point. You can see I have my avatars and stuff, but I hadn't talked to anyone. I've been mute, and uh, this was all on, on the DK2. And actually, at this point, the avatar that you see in the corner is not the avatar I'm using in this video or in this in this clip. A few of these clips were actually with a completely different avatar. Um, kind of a early version of this one, I guess you could say. Um, the hair was blue, actually, and it was a uh, straight cut. It was like a straight cut bob. Um, I don't know if I have any pictures of it, but I don't have that one anymore. But, uh, yeah, that one had like a hoodie that said, Not our robot across it. <laughs> so that, that was an early version. This is actually really nostalgic. Oh man, back when uh, it was quite popular, wasn't it? All the memes and everything brought so many people. Fear Chat peaked at like twenty thousand people that uh, during that time. <laughs> oh, back when I, I used to censor my videos, I want everything to be be family friendly. <laughs> I, I put a lot of effort into these early videos. Now it's like a little bit quicker editing. That's I don't want to say lazy, but at this point, um, everything was I would just go to a random world and just try it out. And then at the end of the day, I would leave, and I usually wouldn't have anyone at it. It would be just kind of go explore it and just uh, look at what's going on, look at the people. And uh, yeah, I wasn't really making friends at that point. It was just seeing what was going on. <laughs> the grand lasagna. I can't say really I'm surprised. Is that lasagna? <laughs> <laughs> so my VR chat story, yeah, I played in October 2017, I played for a few months, and then when Knuckles came out, and that whole thing, I actually left for a bit, because um, my laptop at the point just couldn't handle it. We are here, uh, so channel 14 this was news. actually pretty close to it's when I started coming back. Um, so yeah, it's not uh, completely... New, but it's new to VR Chat after Knuckles. I have been used to VR Chat before Knuckles, and then this is new to VR Chat after. So I guess in a way, it's not really clickbait. <laughs> I was. It is a first impression. It is, let's put it that way. It is a first impression of VR Chat post Knuckles. 
I didn't know how to, I didn't know how to take this, especially as a mute. So I, I, I didn't talk, and all I could really do was just kind of nod my head. Oh, I forgot I put this in. I remember I, I was thinking about this a little while ago about like. Um, I remember, I remember recording this footage, and I remember thinking just like a couple days ago, actually, like, oh, I missed that. I should have put that in a video. I forgot I did put it in a video. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> uh, my first VR chat video. Oh, it's my, my avatar next to my Mabinogi avatar. Man. <laughs> I remember I was so proud of this video because I uh, ran into, into Tasha, or VR Trap Man. This is, oh yeah, I started to slowly condense the intro a bit. Actually, no, I think this one's still original, but. Let's see. Yeah, it's still got a little turnaround, all the Mabinogi stuff in the beginning, and then it goes to VR chat. Idea, I guess I was thinking, was like, this is the uh, Mabinogi persona, Mabinogi player gets experienced into VR chat, and it was okay, but even now, I think my intro should actually be shortened even more. Because who wants to sit through the same intro every single time, and it's long, it gets kind of repetitive. The barking Pikachu. Okay, I, I missed this this uh, desert bus map. It's still on there, but no one goes on there anymore. I missed when this was like full. It was it was really fun. The tie the tie pod tie pods mean. Oh yeah. Okay, so I'm not using the DK2 in this one anymore. This one I'm actually using my friend's um, Acer Windows Mixed Reality. Before I got my own. I had, I still had my DK2, but uh, this one, I uh, yeah, I got to borrow my friend's uh, Acer Mixed Reality, and I was experiencing having hands for the first time. Still mute though. Oh, uh, there's Tasha. <laughs> so this is actually in one of VR Trap Man's videos, an early one. Um, I think it's yeah, VR Trap Man, Desert Bus, or something like that. Um, so I'm in the background a little bit. Um, in that video, uh, from Tasha's point of view, I think I like pointed, and then I like stopped, and then like Tasha put in like uh, captions of, like uh, like the I the I know that Tasha is VR Trap Man. Um, but f <laughs> at that point in that video, in Tasha's video, I like freeze. I'm stuck there. Um, that was actually me lagging for a moment. So yeah, the, the, these two, like, rainbow characters, um, yeah, to see the other half of it, just go watch Tasha's video, where they, uh, continue on their thing and <laughs> they end up getting, getting, uh, trapped. At this point, my avatar as well was shorter. Um, this one... Yeah, it was about four feet tall, actually, which was something I was not aware of. I thought my avatar was five feet tall, and for some reason, when I went back into Unity like months later, I realized it had been like scaled down to 90%, and uh, yeah. <laughs> the whole time I've been playing with an avatar shorter than I thought I was playing with. And I remember late nights just editing these. At this point, I wasn't or even now actually, but um, when I started this, I wasn't trying to get um, well known or anything. Uh, I, I just I really liked editing videos, that's all it was. I uh, had previously been making a whole ton of TF2 videos, and I would just edit them all together, like the TF2 frag videos and TF2 jump videos. Um, that channel has been cleared completely. Um, a little bit of a falling out with a friend, but um, yeah. So I was, just, I just wanted to edit videos, and that's something. Back then, I uh, put a lot of effort into these videos with the uh, little captions and the uh, icons, changing expressions on the side. 
I don't think I would do that now. I don't have the same motivation. <laughs> I've gotten lazier as I've gone on. But the question to you guys is, is the content better? Please be honest. All these different outros, I kept trying to uh, do something that would eventually become my own. Um, <laughs> which I still haven't figured out. <laughs> In my current videos, almost every outro is different. Because <laughs> I can't decide. Oh. Uh, back in Uganda. So this was a few months after the meme had kind of come and passed. I honestly thought it was done, but it was still going quite strong, actually. I guess I kind of miss the whole Knuckles thing. I guess I miss it because I, I didn't experience it. <laughs> I left during the Knuckles thing, so I never experienced it. So, I guess that makes sense why I kind of wish I could have seen it. Because it was an iconic part of VR Chat's life. They never did rise up. Shorten the intro. Oh yeah, and in the uh, previous hub. I missed this hub, actually. I liked the original hub, but I liked that one because it was so full of people. Yeah, this is a good experience walking into the pug. First thing you experience is just people yelling at you. Sadly, this one is for the cancer. They're all full of cancer. <laughs> oh yeah, so this one, I noticed nuts, okay, there's nuts. I didn't notice Ross before. I, I, after I put the video up, and I walked back a few times, then I noticed, hey, that's Ross from Game Grumps. But in the moment, I completely ignored Ross and only saw nuts. <laughs> oh, these guys. <laughs> this guy was... Uh, Impressed by the uh, VR, and the other guy just wanted to get a peek. At the time, I wasn't used to that, so I just kind of like I was just kind of sitting there and just kind of looking around. I didn't know what to do. Oh wow! Extra. <laughs> One. <laughs> that caught me so off guard. I, f I fell over laughing. Oh, I'm and this, and thus started the uh, evolution of Jamie starting to give out head pads and acting a little bit cute in front of me. <laughs> uh, yeah, wasn't an SAO fan, so. <laughs> My 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 mirror. This is my mirror. <laughs> you go look for another server, babe, because it's mine now. Anything good? I didn't good. know how to respond to this. Uh, uh, okay. If I was talking, I probably would have said something. But uh, as a mute, what can you do? I love you. This is my mirror. Did you make it? I remember this. This is the first time I got, ever got crashed. I didn't know what it was. I just figured it was like some sort of glitch or something. Um, and yeah, and this avatar was actually known for crashing people at the time. Um, but I didn't know about it. But yeah, it would just come up to you and then it would activate the uh, particle effect or whatever. And then, uh, yeah, you'd crash if you looked at it. So we got one more video um, from when I was mute, and that's probably my favorite one. It's, sometimes it doesn't get exactly rebuilt, so you have to make sure that the student <laughs> dies so the entire school gets. The Doki Doki map. It's kind of tough. It was a really good school map. It's um, another map I actually really, really miss. I love going there in public instances, and uh, yeah, you could just go and. There is always something going on. You go into the classrooms and you got people um, having their own little um, uh, lessons and stuff. And you don't see that much anymore, which is kind of sad. 
Your chat's changed so much. Yes, but he's offline right now. <laughs> Okay, so the funny thing about this, this was um, recorded after this part. I saw him first doing this drifting stuff, and I record all that, and then after that I found him outside and did that little skit where I was like uh, messing with it because I knew it would work for a video. <laughs> Editing, man! I mean, he's got a. Yeah, this is the first time I actually saw him. We were just here talking in the hallway. Or, I wasn't talking, but they were talking in the hallway. And then I hear this. Yeah. You What the hell? No speeding in the hallway! This was so fun. Okay, get back over here! The gentleman needs to have a word with you. If you didn't notice, I did, I may have enhanced the, uh, running in the 90s. The actual model only had, like, um, just, like, the loop of, kind of, the riff. I, uh, edited in the actual song, so it's a little bit better. You didn't see anything. This is so cute, I just grab it. I just strangle it. Then again, you're cuter, so maybe I'll do that in But then again, I've seen the rule 34 about this, so no, I'm not oh, going to do this. I will be honest. I do I somewhat I miss playing mute. Wait, hold on, you have a small furry trying to attack um, There's a whole different personality to, to being mute. When, you, when you're talking in VR chat, almost everything is done. Uh, just oh, to your voice. <laughs> when you're mute, you have to be creative on how you communicate. And <laughs> A good mute in uh, VR has great personality. They're really fun to be around. Anything could happen. Oh, man. It's, it's changed so much. It was good, but it was also bad. <laughs> you want some banana? Oh. <laughs> And I, I didn't know how to take this. I got the buy here. I just I I was done. Just in a quarter. Curl yeah. into a ball and wish you were dead. Wait, is this cube? Did you do this? <laughs> well, a knuckles of mercy. So bad it's good. Me that I'm a freaking kid and I'm eight years old. Wait, how old are you? Are you fucking eighteen plus? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking 18 plus. Yo, are you 18 plus, dude? <laughs> this game is actually for fat teens and feel, <laughs> feel bad. Yeah, yeah, this kid was like such a troll. But everyone just turned on them, and it's like, I feel kind of bad for them, but it was just too funny. Your cousin is coming, so beware. She can run. <laughs> As you may have noticed, by this yeah, point, I didn't care about the censor. If you want to talk crap about me, she is coming so hard. Oh, no, the word weakness! <laughs> what a lolly scratching me! <laughs> I wonder how many people thought I added in <laughs> that Seinfeld ending. I didn't do that. That was someone's avatar. But yeah, that's uh, all I've got. That was my original four videos when I didn't talk. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I just want to say thank you all so much for supporting me, and for uh, 600 subscribers. It's, uh, I, everyone says it, but I couldn't have done it without you guys. And, uh, yeah, I just want to say thank you, and, uh, see you next time.